hello friends welcome to my youtube channel my name is davis today i'm going to show you how to add a table in your wordpress website so we are going to go back to our dashboard then we are going to hover over plugins then we are going to add a new plugin then we are going to search table press from here and then this is the plugin that we want we are going to hit on install now then activate and now you can be able to see that we have our table press from here so we can click here to allow and continue or we can skip but let us just allow and continue and then we can now create our first table here so we have all the tables that you you will have created here so we'll be able to see them here so if you want to add a new table just click on add new and then let us call it a sample table we can also describe it here and then we can also define now the number of rows that we want and the number of columns that we have so i'm going to use the similar columns and rows that we had used so five rows and three columns and then i'm going to hit on add table so you can be able to see that we have a new table in here and now we can be able now to start entering our data so So this is our table and now we can be able to manipulate the same table here using this. So we can insert a link, insert images, we can add rows here. For example, now we can, if we want to add some rows down here, we can just select it like that and now decide to add maybe you want another five rows and then click on add. And you can see that five rows have been added the same as columns we can add a column using the same here so let's add just two columns then click on add and you can see we have two columns here that have been added now we can duplicate rows so for example you have this row and you have we want the same row so you can click on duplicate and we'll have another row here you can move the rows up and down for example this one just click on it to highlight and then you can now move it maybe up or down depending on where you want let us just move it up so you can see you have rearranged this particular row now the best part about this thing is that you can now search this data so what we are going to do is now after manipulating it the way you want and entering the data the way you want you are now going to um, copy this link uh, copy this short code so we are going to copy it then make sure that you have saved this table and then we are now going to go to our post then add a new post then we can decide to call it table 2 and now uh, before publishing you can decide to use the Gutenberg so you can just click here and search for a short code so you can use this short code uh, but now I want to show you, uh, you if you have Elementor how you can go about it so I'm not going to use the short code from Gutenberg I'm going to use uh, Elementor so let me just publish this particular post and now edit it with Elementor let me just open it on a new tab first here so that we can see how it will look and then open it with Elementor now from here you can be able to add a new box maybe this is where we want so so I'm going to add the short code here so I'm going to click on the plus sign and then I'm going to look for a short code here. Then I'm going to drag and drop it here. And then I'm going to paste the short code here. So you can see that we have the table here. And once I hit on publish. And now I come to this page and refresh. 
now you can be able to see now we have the same table here and now we have a searchable database here so that we can now search what we want so maybe mongolia so you can see we have mongolia here and once i highlight on the title you can see that when i hover over it changes the color so this is how you do it and if this video has been helpful please don't forget to leave a like and if you are new to this channel please don't forget to subscribe thank you and see you on the next one